So I want to share this valuable lesson, and it's got a little humor to it as well. Um, not only is it a very important lesson, but it's got um, some funny stuff. And I heard this when I was a young man, and I live in Phoenix, Arizona now, but I lived in Ohio at the time. And I want to make sure I send this over to my buddy Matt over in Cleveland because the story is called Don't Be the Little Old Lady from Cleveland. <laughs> I swear, this I heard this story. So this is a true, this is this is a really good lesson. But I love the fact that Matt's in uh, Cleveland, Ohio, and uh, the story is about a little old lady in Cleveland, Ohio. So uh, back in those days, uh, they were so worried about war and bombs dropping. Uh, there was rumors that, uh, you know, uh, China or Russia was going to drop all these bombs and kill everybody. And there was this little old lady from Cleveland <laughs> that ran around and said... <laughs> the bomb's going to drop. You know, she would hide. She would be scared. She, every day was just a mess about the bomb dropping. And the moral of the story is don't go all to pieces before the bomb drops. I am in the cancer world and I have met so many survivors that told me that they were diagnosed and we're told they had six months, a year, maybe two years to live. 15 years ago. True, I'm, I'm not kidding you. This happens to me every day. And you hear these stories about people that are diagnosed with cancer and stop in their tracks in fear. Or how about coronavirus? People, you know, not leaving their homes and, and bunkering down and, 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 you know, you got to get sunlight and you got to get fresh air and you can't go all the pieces before the bomb drops. So valuable lesson about the little old lady from Cleveland. <laughs>